Okay, the video that you're about to see, the gentleman that's on the screen now is Nicholas Dutree. He is from France, and he is one of the competitors that I also competed with at the Clover Creek Invitational Tournament in Toon, Tennessee on Labor Day weekend. He, he uh, asked me to put a GoPro camera on the wing of my Calypso glider that we were out playing with. The following video is what was captured. And the Calypso is a stock airplane distributed by Hobbyco. It's under the fly zone line. Um, great flying airplane. It's a power glider. And what you can see here, this is John Schroeder's and uh, John and Tina Schroeder's property. He's retired and basically invested into this. Uh, it's a sod farm in essence with the golf course style manicured fescue grass. I don't know how many acres, but it's huge. And as we can see, we're making a turn around here to come back to the flying site. That is his manicured flying site there in the front with the building in the middle of it is air conditioned. And that's John's private hangar. The white line that you see below it is a fence that John put up for events. That's uh, kind of like a crowd line. If you look to the left there underneath the fuselage, you can see some of the trailers that are already coming in, getting ready for this invitational contest. The mowers that you see out there on the field, those are his staff that daily go out and mow this runway to keep it at the proper height. They found that if you if you keep it cut on a daily basis, there's no risk of clippings and it, it's easier to maintain. And as you can see, the clips have got the prop folded back and we're just making a nice slow pass down the flight line. There you can see one of the airplanes out in front of the hangar. This hangar has two big garage doors on it and is big enough to equip about 15 to 18 40 percent airplanes it's got a full shop in there woodworking uh, it's very nicely done and again we're going back around here uh, taking another look at the flying site now john's property extends all the way out there to the tree lines and also out to the left past where those farm buildings are and the houses and everything is for this particular contest as you see we'll get closer to it he actually cut another practice runway in on another part of his property and that was to allow guys that were doing freestyle practice to go over there and practice to get out of the way. Now as we make around this, make a turn around the corner here, you'll see actually one of the guys is out there flying now, he's doing some practice. You can see him down hovering over there over the runway there on the right side. Now John's house is right now in front of us there with the pool. Very nice place. He's uh, He's very, very meticulous on, on his property, keeps everything very nicely, uh, you know, upkept. Uh, we're making around, uh, making a turn around here, the, the big green top barn you see there is for all his farm equipment and everything. Now the other barn that was in front of us now, John uh, every year does a school for uh, teenagers for youth camp to come in and he teaches uh, aerobatics over a month's time. And what will happen is they come in from all over the country and John and Tina host them at no charge, which is really, really nice. And he basically works with them and teaches them uh, competition aerobatics and training. And um, he's got uh, guys that have been coming there for three or four years at a time. Uh, does a really, really good job. He's, he's a, he, he really works well with the kids and uh, I think what he does there is very, very beneficial. And again, you know, John is uh, its one of those guys, and Tina as well, you know, is a great host. Uh, they put on this, this contest. Um, they, they just do a, a good job as host and, and open up this big estate and property for everybody to come in and enjoy and have a good time for the contest. It's, a, it's an invitational tournament. As you can see right now, we're coming back to where we launched from, and this is just kind of like a high-speed pass down by the trailers and there we are on the right hand side going by and we'll come around here to the right and make a little bit of a turn come back in for landing and again this is all his property nice little shadow of the airplane down below us oh there I am I hope I don't hit myself Oop. oh God, I gotta say that was a 10 if I must say so myself. Anyway, that's a quick little tour of John's property and uh, a little flight with the Calypso powered sailplane by uh, Flyzone.